Bainstoke Bison took on the Swindon Wildcats this weekend in a double header, the second of which taking place at the Planet Ice Arena. The claws were out after the break as the Wildcats took the lead through Lee Richardson. The Bison thought they had drawn level. Unfortunately for them, the referee disagreed. However, it didn't take long for the Bison to level the score as Joe Miller slid the puck past Dean Skins. The Wildcats regained the lead as Aaron Nell reacted quickest to make the score 2-1. Not long after, Hoog made it 3-1, sending the puck past Stevie Lyle, leaving the Wildcats purring at the end of the second period. As the final period began, it was clear that things were heating up on the ice. But it was the Bison who came out galloping in the third period, with Greg Owen reducing the deficit to a single goal. Moments later, Owen again coolly slotted home with the equaliser, sending the game into overtime. It was left to Joe Miller to ram home the winner, showing persistence to rebound his original shot. The 4-3 victory left the Bison dancing with delight. The occasion turned out to be bittersweet, as it was the last game for fan favourite Thomas Fotjik. Despite some impressive displays this season, the Bison decided to release Fotjik in order to sign Czech forward Yaroslav Chesky. Chesky will make his bison bow as Saturday's derby with the Slough Jets. Lewis Salter, Winchester News Online, Basingstoke.